Hello, what's up and what's happening everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we got a game. SEC action. We're going to be taking on Ole Miss. They are coming on a... They, they, they just lost the last game is what I'm trying to say. They lost the last game, so they're coming in on a one-game losing streak. We have won four games in a row, and we're trying to keep that streak alive. We are the number four team in the country. Let's do this thing, bro. Ole Miss, prime you. It can get better, but it might not get no better than this, at least for today. Anyways, man, we're going to kick that thing deep. Rogers, he's going to take that thing, and he breaking tackles. He weaving through traffic. He looking really good. He playing with a lot of heart, a lot of strength, and a lot of pride out there as he gets that one to the 34 yard. Now, they're going to do a play fake sack instantly. Not a good look. That kick return was fantastic. It was fabulous. It was really nice. The offensive possession, not so much. So, first down and 10. Gardner looking downfield. Medlock is in quadruple coverage. It don't matter. The dude's a beast, man. First and 10. As we are now in Ole Miss territory. Oh, Hudson's wide open. Where's the secondary at? They sleeping. They have fallen behind. Every, I'm going to need you to catch that football, bro. That could have been a touchdown pass. Third down and eight from the 10. Gardner rolling to the left side. Stops. Pops. Fry. I'm going to need you to catch that pass. That would have been at least a first down. And still have to set up for a field goal. The kick is up. And the kick is going to be good. So Prime U strikes first. The Red Hawks are looking good. Another kick return. And it's another nice one. Look at him explosively hit that hole. And now they got to set up at the 33-yard line. So back-to-back -back possession. Start with a good kick return. But end with poor offense by Ole Miss. Bass with the interception. We got this thing going back the other way. Howard with the direct snap. Gets crossed the 20. Picks up the first down. Still rumbling inside the 15. And now we got the second down and fourth from the six. Smith. Talking about Big Sam. Picks up a first down. We're going to look at first and goal. Speed option. Sam Smith in the end zone. Oh, Miss, y'all in trouble, trouble, trouble. It is 10 nothing. Young throwing a pass with a little bit of Gouda on that thing, and that's going to be a first down. First down, 10. Young looking downfield again. Again, he throwing that ball with some cheese, but my boy forgot to hang on to the ball. You need some glue on them fingers, my G, because that ball just slipped right out your hands, and now we recover the fumble. We got this thing going back the other way. Keith Young needs to go to the same glue shop to put glue on his hands as well because we fumble the football and give that thing right back to the Rebels. And then they're going to go up top Sutherland. Gets this one inside the five, so first and go from there. Rodgers gets a nice little head of steam, picks up a gain of three. Now it's going to be second down and go from the two, and that's going to be a touchdown. You saw it. That tip just went perfectly in the Storch's hands, and now we are in a much more contested ball game than we were a few moments ago. But we got Cantrell, and Cantrell does it well. To the 20, to the 10, high step your way into the end zone, son. Touchdown, Prime U, and just like that, the Red Hawks increase the lead back to 10. But here comes Young and the Ole Miss Rebels. That's going to be caught by Brock. He's going to muscle his way past the 30. He got a lot of strength, bro. He's showing a lot of heart out there. I see it. That pass going to be caught by Butler. Butler breaks the tackle. Now Ole Miss is cooking with a lot of grease in Prime U territory. Young rolling out. Setting his feet, throwing that bullet. That's going to be caught by Sutherland. He caught a rocket. I hope his hands are okay. Now they're going to give that ball to Rodgers. Look at him go back across the grain. Look at the cutback. Look at the moves. Look at the vision on this kid. He is nasty, bruh. Just nasty. And now it is a 17-14 ball game. Well, we got a lot of weapons out there. Five receivers say you can let my fifth string receiver eat. You're going to be in trouble. Alexander makes the catch. Gets brought down inside the 30 plus. A five-yard face mask. Tack it on, Mr. Official. Tack it on. Everett makes the catch. Going to get brought down a yard shy of the end zone. So on first and go from the one. That speed option. This looks marvelous. It was effortless the way that we did that. Third down and two. They're going to go with the option themselves. And Young's going to get brought down by Bass, but picks up a first down. They get the ball to Rodgers. Look at him bouncing off the defenders. Still breaking tackles. His second broken tackle on that play. White finally drags him down from behind. So it's second down and go. Play fake. Young rolling out, and that is going to be batted away. So the prime new defense, we might bend, but we ain't breaking so far. And look at that. We get a goal. Line standing, got to set up for a field goal. The kick is up, kick is good. Now, I'm just trying to run out the clock, but it's only nine seconds on the clock. We're gonna get this thing to Sam Smith, who's too good at saying goodbye. Peace on to the defense. 
I'm chucking up the doses and I'm gone, G. That is going to be a touchdown. Now we're going to go into halftime. 31 to 17 is what is on the scoreboard, and we're looking good and we're feeling fine. Garner looking has time. Going to find my boy Everett. Oh my goodness, we are eating on this old Miss defense. Especially the secondary. Cantrell does it well. Gets this thing inside the five. We're looking at first and go from the tree. All tree, y'all. And we're going to get all three of these yards as we get into the end zone. We will take right back over. 38 to 17. Looking for my boy Everett. Makes the catch. He ain't done to the 30. He ain't done to the 20. He ain't done to the 10. He ain't done to the five. He gets all the way to the crib. That's right, baby. Come on home. Your mama miss you. My boy Rogers, he takes it to the crib, too. He's nice, bruh. These SEC running backs, they don't play. We all know this. We all know this. Gardner rolling on out. Gardner getting busy. Gardner on third down, picking up the first down with them feet. First and ten. Wide receiver screen. My boy Everett breaking tackles, making it look too easy. To the 10, to the 5, gets pushed out at about the one yard line. Second down to go from the Uno. We just need Uno, and we get that Uno, and now we are up 52 to 24. Rogers gonna take this thing up that gut. Fumbles the football, but they're gonna jump on top of it, and the big fella Lee, the big old lineman, he gonna rumble, he gonna bumble, he gonna stumble. Now it's third down and one, and they get a three yard TV run. They're gonna go for the onside kick. They ain't going to get it because we jump on top of that thing and we are going to win this one 52 to 31. So it's always a good look to win in the SEC and we might have a chokehold on this thing already. Georgia is struggling. Florida is looking decent right now. Tennessee is also looking pretty well. But those are the main contenders in this uh, division of the SEC conference and I don't think that those boys stand a chance. But I don't want to get ahead of myself we just gotta take it one game at a time one step at a time but speaking of competition we do have a big game as we do take on george but as you can see they're not the same bulldogs they're sitting at three and three they're coming off of a loss it's not a good look when we open up the sports illustrated top 25 polls man atu doing that thing heisman watch i mean this guy from michigan look like he could be a beast who knows player of the week you know it's gonna be a baller from USC getting a sack on the Cal quarterback doing his thing. Conference standings, though, I mean, USC is dominating the Pac-10 yet again. That is going to do it, ladies and gentlemen. We got a big win versus Ole Miss. I will see you manana with another video. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Hope the rest of the day is the best of the day. Y'all stay safe out there now. Peace, love, hot sauce.